these kids we're gonna find out today. So, let's go ahead and analyze these characters. And to that, we're gonna hop into training mode. Let's go. So we are gonna start with Number our man one, GT Vegeta here. And to go against him, we'll go ahead and do Nicholas Khan. So as we test things out on the nameless planet, you know, what a fun map. Let's go ahead and do that. We are going to analyze Vegeta's moves, his skill set, and we're just gonna see what he has going on. So here are some things I like about GT Vegeta. If we look at his kit, right? He has counter impact, wild buster, shield bear, and burst charge. Obviously, burst charge is a charge. Now he has two defensive moves counter impact and shield barrier counter impact is of course a counter and shield barrier is a shield that protects against key blasts. However, if you get hit by any type of melee, the shield goes away. Wild Buster is an attack move. We get hit, boom, shield's gone. All right, all right, let's have him attack us. Boom, counter, we go behind him, and then we do what we want. Wild Buster is a charge in move. And we use that, boom, hits, and then another kick, and then we can follow it up. So here's the thing I like about GT Vegeta's combo game, okay? His combo is pretty straightforward. Boom, hit it down. So yeah, pretty good combo, but here's the thing. You do the six hit combo, you do that, and then you can lead in with Wild Buster and hit, and then you can go in and you can keep doing the same thing. Of course, we can break him, and now, since we did that, let's go ahead and look at some of his supers so we have final shine attack it is a beam blast and we also have super gallic gun which activates a lot faster so final shine three key super gallic gun three key as well all right they're both three key so we've seen this combo game right but he also has super vegeta so of course key based attacks are going to be more powerful um, compared to Super Saiyan which buffs your physical attacks more do that All right and then we can follow him with the ball buster and again combo game and then you can keep going like that you can loop with Vegeta with his combos which is powerful and so that'll help you rack on a lot of damage if you can do that and they don't manage to get out of it, of course. And we have Super Vegeta, which will help with his ultimates. Won't help as much with his um, supers because he does not have any key-based super moves. But let's go ahead and look at his limit burst. So what does he have? He has super armor. So this can either be really good or really bad depending on if you're in a match where people will play if you have super armor on or not. Now, in the community, super armor is, is so powerful of a limit burst that some people actually refuse <laughs> to play. It's kind of like the rules of a duel. There's some gentlemanliness in there, so they'll just be like, you know what, we're not going to play while um, <laughs> super armor is on. Some people will, right? So it just depends on who you're playing against, you know? But those are Vegeta's strong suits, right? He has an awoken skill. He has defensive moves. He has one attack move. He has loops. And his ultimates come out at a pretty decent rate. And next, we are going to use my man, Dispo. Dispo is a very interesting character, right? He's very fast, and I would say that his skills are a little bit different as well. Um, he is very much focused on attack. So if we look at Dispo, we're going to look at his skills, and you'll see what I mean here in a second. So we look at this, Justice Blade, Justice Kick, Sonic Kick, and Maximum Charge. So Dispo also has a charge, right? His Awoken skill, of course, is Supersonic Mode. This is how fast he is without Supersonic Mode, by the way, right? He's still pretty fast. He's good at his combo game. He is definitely a character that is defined by speed. He's not necessarily very defensive. He's very aggressive. He's very much on the attack. So if you like that play style, that'll work for you. Um, you can see he's good, but he's even better once he goes Supersonic. You don't need any amount of key. You can activate it whenever you want. And it makes you really fast, but what it does, you see this, it drains stamina, okay? And look how much faster he is. Now look at his combos, look how much he can do, it's insane, okay? So let's look at his abilities, Justice Blade, right? You hit him, and then it does a little bit of a ranged attack afterwards. Now I'm pretty sure these are all melee based. Justice Kick does a little circle and then it attacks the person. Here's what Sonic Kick does, it does a double kick. So, what you can even do sometimes, right? If you know what you're doing is that you can link his supers together now that's personally my play style I really like to link supers together and we also have justice blade so we can do a justice blade into a justice kick potentially and we can do a sonic kick 
into potentially a justice kick right so if you know what you're doing you can kind of link these together they're not super smooth but you can and of course you've seen supersonic mode now mock dash is his evasive just you know pretty fast evasive here's the thing about his ultimates we have full power energy blast volley which is just a normal one right pretty basic three bars of key his other one circle flash is also three bars of key but here's the thing about circle flash the thing that makes circle flash very powerful is that you don't actually need to stamina break somebody to make this connect right a lot of ultimates you're a lot safer if you stamina break them so they can't break you but with this bow you can kind of use circle flash whenever we'll, we'll go ahead and just fight you know <laughs> we'll, we'll fight a little bit here we'll do a little bit of battling right knock him away and then do some of that and we're gonna do circle flash and here we go look at that okay there are already several of you in the chat to and, with, and super i'm flattered i'm honored that you're again, here like, waiting you really for me I, 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 seriously i'm honored thank you guys so much for being here um uh, let's go ahead and hop onto this thing oh where am i also we're not super sane right now especially because i just had a long string of losing matches in xenoverse before i hopped on here which we'll talk about in a second um your boy was right about something and i'm also angry that i was right <laughs> I gotta admit, I had a, had a bit of a frustrating gaming day today. We'll talk about it, but let's go, <laughs> let's go ahead and um, make sure that we can sound good first. And I'm pretty sure we sound pretty good. So um, let me not have my shoulder turned to the camera like I'm a model. I'm too sexy for my shirts. Not really. Maybe. I don't know. You don't know me. I try my best. Anyway, I think the music's fine. So with all that craziness out of the way, let's go ahead and start our um, cast introductions. And then we're going to go ahead and actually like get into the stream because, you know, it's time to have some fun on this game, which is a lot more fun than like people gave it credit for in the past. But it's actually super kind of fun. And this is a long run on sentence uh, because reasons. All right. Hey, guys, how are we doing? Hello, Con Clan. My name is Nicholas Khan and welcome to another stream for our cast. There is me, Nicholas Khan your friendly neighborhood alien dinosaur man that plays games on the internet for you and who else or what else do we have here we got some things we got some special things all right some special special <laughs> little things that we always have starting with the one the only J -j 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 juice. Remember, it's Jerry if it's like a carbonated juice, like American Clear or Sparkling Ice, but I don't have either of those today. Um, no, no G Fuel either. Uh, we have our little Jumba Juice or Jumbo Juice. Let's say Jumbo. We got to make it our own. We don't want to do a Jumbo Juice. We'll do something unique. It doesn't matter. All right. Anyway, uh, <laughs> on your left or on our left, we're going to have our little... Ba -ba -ba -da! diet soda pop up and i know that's on our right but if you saw the screen caps it on your left so i want to make it work i'm directionally challenged apparently it's okay our diet soda will be revealed later on in the stream but let's go ahead and play our intro music they get into the stream because we want to have some fun and i'm sure you're tired of hearing me introduce everything before we actually play i have not read the comments yet evolve prince vegeta says first e anyway thank you for being here longest comment says seconds thank you both for being here so let's go ahead and play our jingle and get ready to Super poweredly mingle. Hello, Conclan. It's time for another stream today. I know you may be stressed out from dealing with the day, but it's time to have some fun, so put those cares away. We're about to go to digital lands far away. Video games are oh so fun and help us to escape, but they also tell stories that help us to relate. Who knows where this will take us, the places we will go. But let's find out together, cause it's time to start the show. You are right, it's time to get started before we end up here all broken hearted like your boy Nicholas Khan who's already mad because of the Xenoverse 2 experience he just had. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, let's go ahead and pump up something a little more exciting. I don't know, uh, call it Fashion Week. All non-MCU outfits are 50% off. Oh my goodness, what a sale. Marketplace item, let's look at that because guess what? I don't know what's in the marketplace right now, but let's go back to the music. And you know what? I wanna do something a little different. A little some some a little different let's do let's do indie pop let's do it a little bit of that a little bit of that pop indie i had diet soda yesterday it was amazing to the point where i saved half of it for the next day really <laughs> well i gl i'm glad you liked it the the nectar of the cons as i'll call it <laughs> i'm glad you're enjoying the nectar of the cons 
join the Khan clan together through the power of diet soda. We will take over the world. Not really. But if people hand it to us, we'll be like, yeah, we'll do the best we can, you know. Ooh, okay, cool. We probably should do that and buff something. There's bundles now. What? Whoa. Flashback bundle for Kate Bishop, like all her old costumes. Whoa. I would get these. But as you can see, I have, what? Did he use bronzer in this one? Look at the hawk, man. It's like he got sunburnt. As you can see, I have no credits. So we got to play the game to get some credits. Hold, hold on a second. Hold on a second. What is that weird purple looking Spider-Man suit? Again, I don't like, okay. Listen, we did a whole video based off of this, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you again, just to show you my disdain. These are all awesome. Um, my disdain for that little teardrop collar on Spider-Man's outfits. He's never had a collar and I don't like capes that much because of Incredibles. It's just stupid. These costumes would look so much cooler if they didn't have that stupid collar in the back. If you like the collar, I'm sorry that I'm just hardcore insulting this, but I hate it. I hate it so much. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. It's the worst. Anyway, let's spread some positivity and hop into the game, all right? Let's do some of that mess. Let's decide who we're going to play today. Um, I would play Hulk because he's my main, but I gotta get more credits, you know, so I can not have to pay for Winter Soldier's uh, advanced track when he gets released. Mm. I don't really have anything that's strictly superhero-esque, so let's go ahead and put on the energy sword behind us like we usually do. At this point, I don't like to play without a prop. I feel like it completes my look, and it's just fun, you know? A little prop, or a little background, you know? I'm obviously not going to be doing this one because that's a insult to the brand <laughs> i believe the purple spider-man is prowler miles morales is uncle is it based off of prowler is it really i thought they all just had a purple one i mean that's cool i would do the web but we're probably not gonna play spider-man today um yeah i'm just gonna do the energy sword since we're probably not gonna finish xenoblade chronicles 2 on stream because you guys you know i like the let's plays are fun but like you know i don't know i'm just kind of focused on xenoverse 2 content unless you guys really want me to bring it back i would but like you guys probably don't you know so it's okay it's okay shipments refresh that's refresh refresh ref con can't speak refreshed i'm running out of money how do you get more money by the way i don't need Hawkeye Civil War suit, but I'll buy a couple of these just because I want to check if, like, I get anything good. Tell me something good. Oh, nothing. I got nothing. Get out of here. It's not a costume that I want. Okay? It's fine. Uh, what do I actually have to do? I'm pretty sure. Sorry, I was just surprised by the upbeat nature of this song and how it sounds like Mr. Blue Sky because it sounds like mr blue sky we don't have okay we have to do all new hawkeye uh defeat enemies while locked on is active defeat enemies is hawkeye with bow headshot i don't want to do anything with hawkeye today uh oh i haven't done that for him probably do that actually earth's mightiest heroes complete hawkeye's heroic mission chain and black panthers but what is this heroic mission chain i don't even see it Yo, the Mighty Jane Foster. Hey. Um, the Panther King. Heroic Mission Chain. Fine. Fine. Well, actually, we should probably do his, uh... Do the training chain for Mr. Black Panther. So let's go ahead and become the Black Panther. Now, I kind of wanted to save Black Panther stuff, but I'll do a little bit of it now. I want to save it for November when War for Wakanda... Not War for Wakanda. Wakanda Forever is coming out, but we'll be in a little bit, you know? So, the thing I want to talk about, by the way, is that you know how in my best DLC 14 character video, I mentioned that this build was one of the best characters when the DLC first released, but once people learned how to play against them, he was going to fall off a lot. Um, your boy was right. I could not have been more right. And I cannot be more angry that I was more right. Because I've been trying to get some... Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm trying to get some footage for a video I'm working on. A video that, like, for all intents and purposes, I want to put out by, like, tomorrow at the latest. Probably won't get it tonight. Because of this stupid... 
I can't get a win with this ball. I've gotten wins with other characters and I'm trying to record, but no matter what I do, I cannot get a win with this ball. He is the worst character in this game. I don't care. Like, I don't care what you think, how you feel. I hate him with a passion that can only be described as the passion of a burning, a thousand burning fiery suns. This bow is one of the worst characters besides literal joke characters in Xenoverse 2 and I'm not kidding you. I am not kidding you. My opinion on him has completely changed and I didn't think it was that I didn't think it was the best before. I thought GT Vegeta was and I still stand by that because I, I got a win pretty easily with him once I warmed up. Um but yeah, just the worst. He is a menace. I hate him. I do. This boat is the worst. Like, if I have to spend all my time just trying to get a win with this boat, like, it is, it is frustratingly hard. Okay. Oh, pounce. Whoa. Mainly leap off pounce enemy at any time. Okay. Just X to the jump. I got pounce. Ow. What's up? Ow. Hey, 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 what's up? That's not what I want to do. I pounce on you! Hey, hey, yeah, look at this, boom, okay. Oh, 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 let's do a little bit of, oh, oh, a little bit of that, a little of that. I changed with Dispo too, once people started to learn him, I hated him. Like Thermo, <laughs> like Thermonuclear Godzilla's heat. People then started to main him and spammed with Justice Kick. Justice Kick isn't even a good move. It sucks. The only move I can manage to pull off with this bow in an actual fight is um is Justice Blade. And that's just in the middle of a combo. I don't know what's going on if like I just haven't kept up with the movement of people. Like, because movement is hard. Like, if one thing you do need to get good is like defense and movement, and I don't feel like I'm terrible at it. And I'm adapting as I'm fighting, but like just getting a hit on people is hard. I have been doing ranked and people like super sweat on ranked to the point where it's not fun. Like I believe in doing your best and I believe in playing people that are better than you so that you can learn, but not people that are so much better than you that you can't learn and it's just not fun, right? Like I'm, I'm to the point where I'm frustrated and I don't want to be frustrated with Xenoverse because I, I love Xenoverse, you know what I mean? I love Xenoverse, it's a great game, but fighting games have never been my forte. Uh, it's it's just a, a debuffed enemies. To, how 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 are they debuffed? Are they debuffed? Now? I, I don't understand what to do here. Um, yeah, I I don't know how people are doing good with him. It might just be a thing where he legitimately just oh you debuff him and then you feed him. Okay, it might be a thing of just dispo is terrible for me. Like he's just not the kind of character that is good for me to main or, or to play. Right, he just does not fit my playstyle. At least with GT Vegeta, if I can get a combo off, then I can, I can do something. You know what I mean? Like I can do something with him. I can do a combo that does a good amount of damage. But with Dispo, it's like you get a couple hits in, and then people evade. And like I don't know how to use his supers in a way that actually helps me to like win. You know, except for Justice Blade, which I just started using. But you have to cut the combo out early to make sure and mix it up and basically guess so people don't like vanish in the middle of it. Because uh, when you use Justice Blade, you legit like when you use Justice Blade, it, it, it leaves you vulnerable. It leaves you so vulnerable. I should probably save this for Xenoverse 2 so you have something to talk about. But I don't think I'm going to want to talk about it because I'm mad. Like, you don't see Mad Con a lot. I've legitimately been mad these past couple of days because like when I go back to the characters I'm good with, right, Super Trunks, some of my custom partners I've been working with, Mike, Mike Hacks, right, uh, Custom Gohan, which isn't my best character, but I can still pull some stuff off with him, even even GT Vegeta, which honestly I've really taken a liking to, like I, I, I really like it, but like it's it's a thing of like when you playing a character and then like you can't do anything it makes you feel like you're bad at the game and while i don't feel the need to be fabulous at everything i do i don't feel the need to win all the time when you lose like eight matches in a row it's frustrating and it makes it not fun right um every character in dragon Ball Z universe 2 is not for everyone however the only person who knows every character better than any anyone else has to be burkle burkle's on another level burkle is just i don't understand like 
he does like I learned like I think I picked up a lot of the ways that I fight from Burkhole because like I was I would watch his videos to kind of absorb how he fights to get better and I felt like I got better for a while maybe I should keep start watching his videos more often again but like I'll do the same stuff he does and fail and he'll do it and just win and I don't understand I I really don't I, I really don't you know but it, it is what it is it it really is what it is um who do I actually want to play today? I think I might want to do some more cap. Level him up a little bit. Get some of his stuff done. You know, but it's just a thing. I'm just, I am frustrated. Because I've gotten a win with a lot of the other characters that I need to for this video. And while, like, I want to get this video out. Like, this video should have been out, like, three days ago. It just hasn't been because I can't get a win with this bow. And so, it's super frustrating. And you train with trash talkers for years? Yeah. I mean, honestly, though, most trash talkers, I'm not going to say that Burkle's not good, but most trash talkers aren't good. But I do like that he does show his losses every once in a while. Like, I'm not going to hide my losses necessarily, but for videos sometimes, I like to show wins, you know? Especially if I'm trying to showcase a character and show how they're good. Well, how can they be good if I lose with this character and win with other ones, right? It kind of kind of doesn't kind of doesn't work. <laughs> as well as it could. Oh, what? I don't have an emo? Skew me! Give me that one. <laughs> but yeah, it's just, it's just a thing. I just had to talk about it because, like, I, I legitimately, I have not been angry at a video game for a long time. And usually the things that make me angry is because I, I put a challenge for myself, like, you know, do this in the hard mode, or like, you know, it, it's, it's a thing of like, getting an achievement or beating a platformer and like I can get good at platformers like that's my kind of game everybody kind of has that game that type of game that like they're kind of inherently good at and if they're not good when they start they can just kind of keep doing it and like train a little bit and get better in that type for me it's not fighter fighting games which is why it's frustrating because like winning a match with a character is a basic thing it shouldn't be beyond my realm of capability to do it's just that a character's not good for me. But it makes me feel like I'm worse at the game than I feel like I am. But like, oh, let's look at these real quick. Complete threat sectors in the eastern seaboard. Um, oh, what? That's all I have to do? That's easy. Um, threat sectors. Defeat synthoids or protosynthesoids. Okay, defeat 25 enemies without being down. That's actually harder than you think. Defeat high value bounty targets. All these are easy. I don't have to do anything specific. I just, okay. So... Yeah, Threat Sectors, Eastern Seaboard. Let's do it. Okay. Select. Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, like, it, it makes me feel like I'm worse at the game than I feel like I am, like, realistically. Just because of this one character. And I also want to get this video out so I can go back to working on the video I was going to do. Because this was a spur-of-the-moment video. It was not a thing that I had planned to do. It was like, you know what, this would be a cool video idea, let me do this, and I need to do this quick because it's kind of a news thing, and if I don't get it out quick, then, like, it's not gonna, it's gonna be pointless. So, like, I'm just so frustrated, this is the worst. Anyway, when I go to the Whis and Boo mission in the storyline, I was pretty angry. <laughs> mm. You know, for the longest time, the mission that was hard for me in the campaign was, um, Oh, by the way, if you guys want to play, let, let me know your PSN and whatever, and you can hop in. Like, that's that's always an option, especially when we play Avenger, you know? I am Xenoverse, too. Like, it's it's always an option. Um, the well, campaign recon, mission that was hard for me was, um, right before you get your flying license, forces. when you finish up Namek and you have to Commander fight Cooler and Frieza. That was, for some reason, that was hard for me when I first started playing. Then I thought I felt I got better, and now I feel like I got worse, even though I play every week, and I don't know. <laughs> It's just the meta, man. Like, ranked is hard. R ranked is very unforgiving in Xenoverse. You know, like, it probably is in every fighting game, but, like, mm, it's... I don't want to be depressed, though, so let's sing about happy thoughts. Let's, let's be an Avenger. I'll, I'll, I'll get that video out. I just have to get one win, and then I gotta get a win with another... I gotta get a win with Orange Piccolo. And it's literally just background footage, but, like... Feels kind of weak sauce for the background footage to show me losing a bunch. Like, if I was doing it as part of a video, I'd just make it funny or whatever. And be dying on the inside, but, you know, it's okay. 
<laughs> oh my goodness, I'm not actually laughing. Um, I'm attempting to locate the but yeah, agents that's what I was going through. Hey, let me go into Avengers World. I want to avenge yeah. myself. I want to avenge my losses in Xenoverse. It's just, like, here's the thing, okay? Super Saiyan Cabby was right when he said Dispo has the worst Awoken skill because it's like Kaioken but doesn't even give you much. It's not good. It's really not good. Like, and, and it wastes stamina, it doesn't give you much. Like, I don't even, half the matches I'm, I'm playing, I don't even try to use it because like I'm vanishing all the time, which is probably one of the reasons I'm not doing as good, but it's like hard to like, I gotta, I gotta take more hits. I, I gotta take a couple hits and then know when I need to get out of a combo. Um, that would probably help me, right? But it, it, that's that's a thing, and then it's like, we got company. Ugh. steamroller. What is? What's all the special things that are going on? I need to take out high value bounty targets and whatever, and like defeat enemies with like without dying. Let's do this uh, I do light cap. I know like a, a melee focused characters in this game are hard to kind of be good with besides maybe Hulk just because he's a beast. Um, because there's so much range involved in this game, and that's kind of like the big shabanga lang. But you know, I still ah hi hello hello hi 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 hey what's good? But I like Ray. I like melee characters. You know this game is gonna get better and better and better. Like they are definitely the game. Oh by the way, the title, the takeover is official. Is because Embracer Group has officially taken over Square Enix and all that good stuff. Like officially they've done it. So yeah, this game has been getting constant development. They're hiring people on for the game. Like it's. It's a thing. It's a real thing. So this game is just gonna get better and better and better. And I'm into that, because I don't think the game was bad in the first place. I like it a lot. That's why we're playing it. You guys seem to like it too. Um, it, you know, until, yeah, until My Hero Academia Ultra Rumble comes out, and then, you know, Avengers might be, uh, might not be as regular as it is now, you know? But it is what it is. Or I could play some more Dragon Ball Online. I got oof, that's another thing. I've been so busy trying to make videos that I haven't done anything in that game. So like, you're not gonna see that on stream in a while unless you guys really, really want it. And then I'll just work hard to get to level 29 so then I can do a Budokai Tenkaichi. We'll do it on stream, it'll be really fun. And I'll make a video out of it. That's that's the plan there. And then when I become an adult, I'll, I'll stream that. You know, that kind of thing. Woo, woo! Yeah, what you want, sir? Can't be taken out. No, oh, hey, 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 hey. No, hey, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Hey, no, oh, hit me, hit me. What you want? Hit me. Try hit me, sir. Try hit me. Boom. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. That, no, nope, that's not what I want you to do. Okay, okay. I'm gonna read your comment in a second. I'm just, just a little, little busy trying not to die. You know how it is. Oh, ha ha. Let's do a takedown. Oh, I can't anymore. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, no, get out of here. Get out of here. Okay. Hey, what you want? All right. Boom. Oh yeah. We'll throw it, and then I can throw it, and then throw it right back. Oh, let me do it. Let me do it. Yeah. Oh yeah. I'm smashing my shield on the go. Boom. That's how we do. It. Uh, I played Robot Doors, and it was really darn scary. It was when I first died to Rush. Was when I realized the game, this game was not playing. Um. Wait, what? I, I understood the first part, but not the second part. I, with Roblox graphic style, I kind of have a hard time believing it could be scary, but like, I don't know. People can do some really creative stuff in games like that. But like, I also could never imagine anything in Minecraft really being scary. I mean, like maybe the experience could be scary, but not the look of it, if that makes sense. I mean, I could be wrong. I don't want to judge a game that I don't play a lot of, you know, that wouldn't really be fair of me. But, um, I don't know. I'm not really into scary games either. Um, you know, it's not that, like, I don't like being scared. I like to watch. I like to watch people play scary games more than I like to play them myself. Just, I don't know. Because most of them I'm not really into spending money on. Because like, it's not really my thing. Like, I would do it for the same reason I like to eat really spicy food. I don't do it to enjoy enjoy the thing itself i do it to enjoy the challenge you play doors and the graphics of it and the jump scares could get you see i could see how the jump scares could get me i just don't know how scary the graphics can look on a game like roblox which is like even more graphically simple in my opinion in a lot of ways 
than Minecraft, which at least looks, even though the graphics are simple, can look serious. And Roblox it looks very kiddie to me in the graphics department. From, from my opinion, from my opinion, you know, I could be wrong. You know, I probably am wrong, right? You know, but then again, like that's that's a design choice. So when I say I don't like it, it doesn't mean I think the game is bad because I understand that's a choice. It's not a knock to the game. It's just I personally didn't enjoy this thing. I cannot be down. I cannot be down because I want to get that. Go 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 go. Heal me, heal me, heal me, sir. Heal me. Okay, good, 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 good. I got to I got to down 25 enemies without dying five times. You know, that's 125 enemies. Hi, which how are you doing, sir? I need to. Oh, ooh. See, I always dodge when I should block, and then I block when I should dodge, and because of that, I take damage. Whoa! I am imbued with gamma energy. Look at this. Look at me. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Let's go. I am Captain America. Okay? Okay? I am Steve Rogers. Okay? <laughs> Can't stop me. Okay? If you played... Oh, I already read that one. Ooh, snap. Hey, what's up, Kate? My other man. You know, until She-Hulk comes to the game. I wonder how much I'll like Winter Soldier. I probably won't that much. Because, like, I like Bucky in the MCU, but, like, Winter Soldier's never really been my, like, cup of tea. I don't dislike him. I just don't love him. And there are other characters that I legitimately love. So it's kind of like, eh, why would I play Winter Soldier when I could play Cap, you know? has been neutralized. Or widow. Oh, 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 ooh, let's go. Hey, let's go. Let's go. Hey, yeah. What you want? Huh? Oh, I gotta defeat protos. That's part of my thing too. Yeah. What you want, sirs? And uh, un sirs? <laughs> hey yo. Alright. Hey. Boom. 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 Sure. Shabams. Let's go ahead and do this little finisher right here. Right now. Alright, we did it, y'all. Captain America! Hooray! You guys want some music that's a bit more pumpy? Is that what you want? Is that what you want? I have enough music to last us the rest of the stream going just epic now, actually. So I should probably do that. I would do it at the end of this mission, but I think this is gonna be pretty long. Pretty, pretty long, as they say. By the way, if there's anything else you'd want to see me play on Tuesdays, like, let me know, because I'm willing to try stuff. If there's, like, something specifically you guys are like, I want this, and if I don't have it, then I will destroy you, and I will think you are a terrible streamer. It's like, I don't want to be terrible. So let me know. If there's anything you want me to try, I will go ahead and try it. And with the end of that song, it is perfect for us to start our epic music for the day. Ain't it? Ain't it just so? Ain't it? Ain't it? I don't know. That is... You can gain control of the levels network, of that really lowered um, to a point that is surprising system. for me. Okay. So, let's Doesn't talk about... Oh, whoa! You know, uh, oh, Casual Avenger. Yeah, that's what happens. Oh, you're not done? Dang, bro. Yeah, Casual Avenger made a really... Oh, hey, what's good? What's good? What's good? What's good? Made a really long stream just talking about the Embracer group deal going through. So if you guys don't know, like, Square Enix got bought out um, by another company called Embracer Group. So you know how this is about to be year three of Avengers and, and not much has changed until recently or until this year. And a lot of people had a lot of problems with it and all that good stuff. Well, the reason... We had problems with it was because um, the original development team just didn't know what they were doing. They didn't have a clear direction for the game. They were just like, oh, we'll make Avengers and it will sell. And that's not exactly the case. Because, um, you know, you gotta make a game good. Even if it's Avengers, doesn't mean it's gonna be good. There's been a lot of Spider-Man games. I've played all of them from Xbox 360 and beyond, except for Miles Morales, because I don't have a PlayStation 5. Um, Head for the terminal so I can yet. Get you inside the lab. I probably won't even be able to get it Black Friday unless, because they're not going to make a deal this off it. In fact, the console is just getting more expensive. It's hard to get, because of all these product shortages. And it's like, why would you do this to me? I, as a content creator, need to get a PlayStation 5, and maybe I'll just buy one used. 
Like somebody's like, I don't want this anymore because I don't play games no more. We're like, my son didn't do his homework, so I'm going to sell his PlayStation. Do you want it? And I'm going to be like, you are a cruel mother, but I'll, I'll take it. Terrible parenting decision, but I'll take the console. You know, I'm not afraid to say it. I think that is a terrible parenting decision to take away something permanently that was that expensive. Like, are you, are you high? I mean, like, really? I'm gonna be, like, to be honest, like, it's stupid. And like, you know, if you're a parent out there, you may feel differently. Like, I work with children. That is not how you motivate a child to do better, okay? Reward the good. Sometimes discipline is needed, obvi, obvi. But if all you do is like, make them mad because, I'm trying to unlock this thing. I usually don't do this often, but like, I want to, so I'm doing it. But yeah, like, what is the... P oh, here it is. That's... Yeah, there it is. There it is. Okay, now I know where all four of them are. We should be good. Um, but yeah, I just don't think that's a smart way to go about it. Like, if you want to take away the PlayStation for a day or a week, depending on how bad they did it, fine, so they can learn the lesson. But you know what will happen if you take that away permanently? To teach them a lesson, all it's going to do is teach your child that you are cruel and that they need to grow up to be cruel in return so their stuff doesn't get taken away anymore. Right? If my stuff's gonna be taken away permanently just because I'm not perfect, then I guess I have to be as ruthless as everybody else so that my stuff doesn't get taken away. And that's why we have business people that are destroying rainforests to make money. Because their mommies took away their PlayStations permanently. They got parental issues. Like, I don't care about the environment. Who cared about my environment when my PlayStation was taken away? Now, that's a little bit ridiculous and a bit extreme, but like, that's, that's what we do here. We're dramatic. But, but it, it is like a, 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 hold up, hello, you just, just gonna leave it there, Thor, hey, bud, okay, I guess I'll let you do you, I, uh, but yeah, I think it's stupid, <laughs> I think it's super stupid to take away something permanently, and if you're a parent in the chat, and you disagree, well, we can agree to disagree, we can definitely agree to disagree, but I don't think a, I don't believe in a permanent solution to a temporary problem. Right? I believe in teaching people why it's important to be good instead of punishing them to be bad. That's not to say that discipline is never needed because kids that never have discipline grow up feeling entitled and like the world owes them something like they don't have to ever work hard for anything which is a reason why I don't like participation trophies which we'll get into afterwards because I want to finish my conversation on this part move on to the next thing because I do the opposite a lot mostly because of the ADHD is why I'll jump from topic to topic but I don't want to do that all the time because you know <laughs> then the conversation is hard to follow and yeah Beginning I don't think you guys are gonna like that all the time you know but any hoobie doobies it's a thing of like listen the kids not doing their homework i get it like maybe take the playstation away for a week or whatever like or so, and if that doesn't work you need to talk to them about some other consequence but it's like the kind of parents that are like oh i'm gonna take away their bed until they learn to behave it's like your child is going to therapy and your child is going to grow up and not be that good of a person you want to know why because you're not that good of a person your child's going to grow up to be extreme and cruel because you are extreme I'm inside and cruel. Security system. Like, I don't understand what, like, the opportunity to raise a child is a privilege, not a right. Children are a gift, not property. Okay? I don't care what you say or what you think as a parent. Like, I will disagree with you vehemently because guess what? That just shows how entitled you are as a person that you think your children are property and you can treat them however you want. No, you need to love them, you need to care for them, and you need to remember that they are children. They are going to do stuff that's stupid that you as an adult are like, why'd you do that? I don't know. Why do you not know? Because they're a kid. They're a child. They are still learning. Their brain is not fully developed and they don't even have the capability always to make the decisions you want them to make. Now, kids can be very intelligent and mature and smart for their age, but I, even the most system. intelligent 11-year-old, even the most mature 11-year-old is probably not as mature as a 60-year-old. It's just a normal 60-year-old, you know? It's just, 
it annoys me. That that is the thing that annoys me a lot when parents think they own their child and they can treat them however they want, and that's not the case. It is your job to teach them how to be an adult, how to function in society. Most importantly, it's your job to teach them how to be a good person. That's the most important. Thing. And when they think that their children are just there to serve them hand and foot or to do things for them they don't feel like doing or, or this, that, and the third. It, it is very much a thing of like when I hear that I'm like you, I don't know if you really know what being a parent is or if like you should be. Cause like I work, I work with children. And so, like, I hear about their parents. I interact with their parents, right? Like, I work in the school system, and so many parents don't know what they're doing. Like, just, they don't. It's, it's, it's kind of bad. Like, it's kind of, oh, no! Oh, no! Yeah, it's, it's, it's legitimately just kind of, like, bad. Like, hello. Oh, let's go. Can't stop me now. And like I get it, if a kid is like purposefully not listening, there needs to be consequences. I am a believer in consequences. Like obviously if somebody's doing something bad, there are consequences just like there are in society. You commit a crime, you go to jail. Okay. Like, you know, oh yeah, have to pay a penalty or a fine or whatever, whatever. But it's not I'm inside my kid's security. misbehaving. It's uh, I've breached aim like, security network. Uh, uh, the punishment is often too extreme for the crime. You didn't eat your broccoli? I'm selling your PlayStation. You kidding me? You kidding me? You're not a good parent. You're just, you, I'm sorry, but you're not. And you need to learn to do better because that's ridiculous. There's so much stuff in this world that's ridiculous. And while I don't want to call people out because nobody's perfect and everybody's trying their best, I do need to see that you are actually trying to do good as a parent. Like, I, that's what I want to see. I don't expect perfection, but I expect you to try. And I expect you to not be stupid. Right? Like, I think it's reasonable to expect people to not be stupid. Some parents are just, like... The things they do irk me. Because, like, I know what it's going to lead to. I know the effects it's going to have on that child, and I know they're not going to be good. Oh, cool. We're almost done with that one. Complete threat sectors. So that'll be done as soon as we finish this mission. 25 enemies without being down. Got to do it three more times. High value bounty targets. Cool. I don't know how to do that. I got to do another mission for that. But yeah, we're probably going to be playing Cap the whole time, by the way. A number of kidnapped I might just have to make a background for each hero in this game. Help them. But honestly, I'm not committing to that unless this becomes like literally one of the biggest main games on the channel. Cause like, that's a lot. Listen y'all, listen. That's a lot, man. And like this game is fun to play and we play it just so we're not playing Xenoverse every stream. But it's not like, you know, whoa. It's not the end all be all. And like, again, once like Dragon Ball Breakers and my Hero Academia Ultra Rumble come out, Avengers is probably going to be replaced, except for those special moments when a Marvel movie is about to come out or something, and then it's like, okay, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll totally play the game, because it's dying into the movie, and that's fun. Like, you can't deny that that's fun. No, no, why don't my teammates ever get rid of the turrets, especially the ones that have, I don't know, a bow and arrow? Ridiculous, okay? Well, I'm trying to defeat enemies. Oh, cool, awesome. All right, that's done. I don't even know what that was. I will defeat all of you! You know what I'm gonna do? Look at this, look at this. Let me get all in. Look at all these protos I'm about to take away. Proto! Aha! Prototype? Yeah, pro yeah you are a prototype because you're weak. Because I defeated you so easily. Stiletto robot? You wearing some stilettos? Oh, 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 can't stop me now. Oh, 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 come on, what you want, what you want, what you want, sir? Yeah, let's go. Oh, oh, okay. Ooh, oh, 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 okay, okay. Oh, 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 hold up. Oh, 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 okay. Hey, what's good? What's good? Okay, Hulk took him out. Hulk took him out. That's alright. That's alright. That's alright. Alright, 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 alright. <laughs> oh my. Oh, there's more. Hi. Whoa, there's a lot of you now. Ooh. Oh, oh, ah, whoa. Okay. Frame rate went down. That was so much happening there. Hulk's destruction. But yeah, I don't believe in extreme consequences, especially when they don't fit the actual like crime. Like I'm gonna punish you with something that's so bad it's going to scar you. You, you can scar your children pretty easily. You gotta remember that children are not as... 
durable emotionally as adults are. And most adults can't get it together if something bad happens to them. Like, let's be honest. So imagine a child. Imagine how bad that is. They are a child. They do not deserve to be treated like that because they are children. So, like, if they do something really, really bad, I get it. But, like, if they do something that's just moderately bad, uh, then no. And you do everything with love. Like, before you even think about the consequences, like, explain to your child why what they did was wrong. Because guess what? Because they're a child and there's a lot they don't know. There's so much stuff they don't even know is bad. Like, you're talking to you're like, why'd you do that? I don't know, I just did it. Well, that's not good. Oh, I didn't know that was bad. And they might not ever do it again. If they do it again, you know, have a conversation, right? But they teach them. You teach them. You don't just punish them until they get it right. Because how do they get it right if they don't know what's right or wrong? They don't know what's allowed and what's not allowed. If you do not clearly explain the rules to them, then you can't expect them to follow them perfectly, you know? It's just kind of unfair and I've ridiculous. Sent Commander rendezvous location to extract but that is my aid. TED talk for the day. Well, <laughs> that is my TED talk for the day, at least on parenting stuff. I had another point I wanted to make, but you know. I don't remember it, so, you know. Whoa, look at all this stuff we got. We gotta go to the character menu and see everything we did. Whoa, look at all this better gear. We're gonna sell it. You know what happens when we sell it? We get stuff. I'm not even worried about upgrading. You don't upgrade gear until you get like max level. You know what I mean? Like just, just don't. We get a lot of stuff, but we don't get a lot of stuff. We get no money. We get parts and stuff, which is good for upgrading other things, but we don't get any money. You know? Whoa, almost out of space here. Oh yeah, it just goes to that special place anyway when that happens. So, you know, no biggies. No biggies. Um. But yeah, I am excited for where this game is going. I think Embracer Group knows what they're doing. You know what they're focusing on now? They're focusing on online. Okay? They're focusing on online, making the online experience fun, the end game content fun, because that's what this game is. It's a looter. It, it is a looter. So you're supposed to do missions, get better gear, get stronger, and that's just it. They gotta make it more fun. They gotta put in more content. But like, listen, the game is still new. It lost a year of development when the development team that was working on it before didn't know what they were doing. Now that they've hired more people, they have new leadership, they have the Embracer group doing stuff, they really know, they, they know what they're doing now, right? Like at least better than they did from the perspective of like, cool, we have stuff we can do now. And I like that a lot. Uh, uh, increased critical chance. Maybe I should do that. Increased duration of all damage buffs. Uh, okay. Uh, increases the fill rate of vibranium status. Whoa, I... That's cool, but not really what I need, you know? I don't want these. At all, honestly. I can't get rid of these. Hmm. You can transfer them. So, yeah, what does this one do? Because I might increase damage on enemies. Increase status damage. He's not a status damage person. So I'm gonna actually give him this. And then... Wait a second. Yeah, it goes to nine. Okay, yeah, it's one plus one power. Oh, but this gives me valor and might. That's why I have it on. If I upgrade it though, I wanna look. No, I wanna see if it gives me anything. No, fine. Oh, it doesn't upgrade that, fine. Okay, let's stop there for now because I'm gonna need to get more polychlor on. But that's just an artifact. So like, that's not anything that's gonna ever change. Is it going to give me anything different? No, I already have those nameplates. It's fine. Oh, I need some of these. Um, we did a lot now. Let's see what we've got done. This, this. So what we need to do now is defeat 25 enemies without being downed. Defeat high value bounty targets. And to defeat bounty targets, we probably need to do one that's outside. So select. We need to do a mission that starts outside probably. So we got to go to like, I don't know. I don't know. Echoes. Avengers Initiative, complete sight unseen. See, these are vaults that I can't do right now because like I'm not playing my max character. So I can't really do anything like that. Rise and shine, I'm not really worried about that. Uh, faction sign, whatever. Okay, okay. Drop zones, we could do a drop zone. Uh, yeah, let's do a drop zone and open some strong boxes, why not? 
Oh, guaranteed cosmetic item? Yo, let's go do the drop zone in the Pacific Northwest. That's what we do. That's what we do. Uh... Drop zone, drop zone, drop zone. That's what we need to do. Hey, look at this one. I mean, it's a little, it's a little, a little easy. I'm not gonna say it's easy. I, I gotta admit, like, I need, I need a bit more of a challenge, you know? What I gotta do, but I'm gonna make a challenge through. Because I want it to actually be a little hard, you know? Okay, yeah, let's do it. So if you make it harder, I don't know what the extra like bonuses or whatever are, but you know, it is what it is. I don't know why I keep dipping out like that, being like sucked into the other dimensions. Okay, so I'm gonna access the rock. I'm not gonna request specifically anybody. I just wanna see who I get. There's so many characters, we get so many. Let's launch the mission, cause that's what do we do. Hey, would you guys wanna see me play through Guardians of the Galaxy? And like continue it, like on stream? I could potentially do Intel that. provided by our friends at Shield has revealed the location of an elite aim Potentially. We have potentially. To take them out P -p -p potentially. I get. Oh, do I have more skills? I don't think I. I did level up. Ooh, I got skill points. One. Take out the targets. Specialty. To us I need to get these. Yeah. Okay. So I can have hold up to two charges of steamroller. Uh, press R2 as the shield returns from a steamroll attack to keep the shield back out, dealing additional heroic attack damage. That's cool. Increases stun damage. Uh, I'm not building him out as a stun character. I think I want to build him as a critical, critical character. As it might be how I want to build out this Captain America. Captain America. Captain America. Captain America. Yeah. An elite yeah. aim team is close by and on alert. Updating your HUD. Let's do this. I chucked my juice because I felt like it. Hey. No. All right. They're going to fight. No. L let me go. I got to do this quick. I can do it. I can do it. I'm probably going to die. I don't want to die. I want to go to this one. Yeah. Just do the extra damage. Yeah. Because it's, it's just a move I already do. So cool. Excuse me. Ah. Boom. Boom. So I got to defeat certain types of enemies. And I got to defeat 25 enemies without dying. Like that's a one, two. Whoa. Hey, what's up? What's up? Hey, it's good, it's good, it's good. Oh, what's up, Kamala? You're not very high up. We might level her up soon. Yeah, I think I, I next week I might do a Spider-Man stream where I um give Spider-Man another try because honestly I think he's he's kind of he's kind of trash. He's just not fun. But here's the thing: Hulk wasn't fun either when I first started. I just love Hulk, so I was like, I'll stick with him. He'll get better. He'll get better. A lot of heroes in this game, especially like the the. The original ones and some of the earlier releases aren't fun when you first start playing them and they don't get fun until you get really powerful. Other characters were fun right off the bat. I liked I liked um Kate right off the bat. And then of course as you level her up she gets better. Hulk I didn't like until I got max level and I could do everything and I felt like a Hulk, like a beast, like a monster. Right? Every member of the elite team must be um, defeated. Jane, I liked right off the bat, but that's just because Thor's a really well-designed character and she's basically Thor. Um, she does have some differences, and I'm sure they'll try to make her more different with patches, maybe. Or maybe not. They, they didn't really put a lot of effort into Jane, Thor, because they just wanted to get a new hero out, like, as... Because they were working on other stuff. Here's the thing. Alright, the new direction, new leadership, they know what they want to do with the game. Like I said, they're working out online, and that's I mean, why they're not doing... Um, hey, no, 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 no. Alright, let me do this. This is the buff, right? Hey, yeah. Look, give me my health back, sir. I need my health back. That's what I need. Hey, what's... Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Okay, no, because that's red. That's red. Okay, okay, let's, let's go, let's go. You know what? I might, have to, I might have to do another heroic. Okay, cool. I got some health back. Cool, 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 cool. Oh, is this a healing thing? Oh, out of the way. Out of the way. No, hey. What's, hey, what's up? What's up? No, oh, crap. No, no. Dang it. Okay. Yeah, that's um 25 enemies one. It's going to be hard with people like this. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to use this. I'm going to use it. Okay. And I'm going to use my new thing that I just unlocked. Oh, yeah. More heroic damage. Yo, oh, hey. Hold up. No, excuse me. Uh, oh no 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 dang it dude come on come on 
Really? Ugh. Ugh. I gotta get better at Cap. I gotta get better at playing this man's. Oh yeah, you, you can take him. Kinda mad though. Kinda mad. Oh! What's up? He's webbed. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Spider-Man. Ooh, ooh, no, 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 no. Ooh, 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 ooh. Starting to pull out some Xenoverse type combat here now. Oh, yeah, let's go, let's go. Oh my goodness. Oh, dang, Cap. All right, he said you're done. You're done. He said, you want, you want to know a secret? You're done. It's over for you. <laughs> Whoa, dang, Cap. He said, bam, chicka bam. Hey, look, look at these prisoners. We gotta save them. This isn't nice. You're a very mean person, but that's what you do. Hey, we defeated the enemy squad. But yeah, they're making the online experience more fun. They're doing a lot of patches to like how missions work. They're putting in more content. Um, they're really working on making the experience better. And because of that, they haven't necess they haven't focused as much on releasing new heroes, so they still are, which is okay. Um, but they're not doing expansions anymore. Because the problem with expansions is that they're releasing them for free, so Good people come back and play them. And then once victory, the story is done, they get rid of the, the they, like they stop the playing the game. Keep That's what happened to me. After I finished War for Wakanda, I, I didn't keep playing, you know? Beat high value bounty targets. Well, what's the high value bounty targets, bro? Whatever. Okay. Like that that was that was legitimately me. You know? I did that. And then I came back to the game now. But yeah, it's just the thing of um they gotta focus on what makes sense. So there's still gonna be story, but it's gonna be attached to the end game content. Like to the new missions they release, new enemies and stuff, new heroes, and it's not gonna be an expansion. They're just gonna like kind of weave the story in little by little, if that makes sense. Um, which I think is a good direction for them to go in. But that's why they just kind of released Jane. Cause they're like, we need, we wanna give you a hero because we know we're working on a lot of other stuff, but the heroes is what bring people in, right? So they were like, we can't just not give you a hero. And we have a good amount in the game. A good amount to level up too. So I really do like where they're going with this. And I think it's going to be good. Um, I'm really excited to see how this game progresses moving forward. I have to open more strong boxes. Fun. But yeah, that's just kind of my thoughts on it. And like where we're headed with this game. We can talk about it more. Ooh, I like that. I do. We can talk about it more. But we can talk about it more after the break because it is time for us to go on break so go ahead and stretch your legs use the bathroom get a snack and we will continue in a few minutes we will not be gone very long we usually aren't but don't go away just yet you know there's more fun to be had coming up soon so we will be right back unlocked all five custom partners for dlc 14 so we're going to go through all of them they have all been customized and i'm going to determine which one i think is best out of this latest round of custom partners we're going to be playing with super saiyan god goku super saiyan 4 gogeta super saiyan god vegeta super baby 2 and Goku Black Base. Now I have optimized all these for my best play style. So I've optimized all these characters for the way I play so that I can able to see how good they are at their highest potential for how I play. So we're gonna go through all of them and then I'm going to tell you which ones I think are best. And how are we gonna test this? Well, there's only one way to test it. Ranked matches without limitations. And let's go. We're gonna play the original version of the characters as well just to compare them and see how much better the custom partner is. Because that's also a determining factor in which one is the best custom partner. How much better are they than their original version? And we're about to get trashed because I can't fight Hit. I cannot fight Hit for the life of me. Hits are always my worst character to fight in this game. Just like, honestly, in Smash Bros, Captain Falcons, all right, are the bane of my existence in Smash Bros Ultimate. Oh man. I'm not gonna let you finish. Ah. Oh, 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 okay, okay, I see you, I see you. Ah, ah, no. Look at, look at these looping combos, bro. Okay, no, we're not having this, we're not having this. Oh, oh, no, ah, oh, can I get around you? That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, I'm just gonna, can I knock you away? I just do, oh, no, okay. Oh, oh, can I grab? Let's go, let's go, let's go. We have key blast cannon, I need some stamina back. This man's about to break me. Ugh. 
Oh, oh, okay. Good, 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 good. He could he couldn't do the combo. Okay. Ah, come on. A little bit of this, a little bit of this. Alright, oh, oh, back, back. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. I'm gonna go around. I'm gonna go around. I'm gonna go around and then hit. Come on. That's how we do. That's how we do. Oh, oh, okay. Uh Key Blast Cannon. What does that one do? Okay, that one's like a knockback. Um, you can use that at the end of a combo. Dang, I'm not gonna I don't want him to stand to break me, so I'm gonna go ahead and eat this damage a little bit. Okay, so right off the bat, you know. Super Saiyan God Goku has some good moves. Uh, he doesn't have a counter. Counters are nice. <laughs> oh, we... Oh, gosh. This is bad. Okay. Key Blast Cannon. We have Super... Hey, what's good? Oh, oh, snap. Ah, oh, come on. Ugh. Ah, uh, that didn't work. That didn't work. No. Okay, come on. <laughs> oh, Super Armor? All right. I don't know if he's going to fight me or not. If he fights first, then I'm going to fight back. Okay. Okay. If he's gonna do that, then I'm gonna fight you with super armor. I don't care then. I don't care. All right, you started it. Okay, you did this <laughs> You did this is there still a way we can win? Ah, come on. Oh, 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 I feel like the meta's evolved and I haven't evolved with it You know what I mean? Like I feel like I was playing good for a bit and now I feel like Good play has moved past me again. I just I'm just not there, you know <laughs> Okay well, there's that. All right, this is sad music, which is fine because I'm about to lose anyway. Oh, man. He says stop wasting my time. Okay, Mr. Hit. Yo, listen, you are a hit, okay? You're a hit with all the fans. And <laughs> okay, now we're going to use custom partner Goku. All right. That was one of the stupidest things. Making Goku a kid again in GT. I hated that. I hated it. They wanted it to be more like the original Dragon Ball. I was like, listen... The things people fell in love with with Z wasn't like the adventure. It was the okay, aliens and the this. battles and the power levels, right? You know, that's that's what people loved Z for. That's why when they it got a little bit better once people started doing the um, once they started kind of making it like Z and doing like more big enemies and stuff. But it still wasn't as good as Z. It just it just wasn't, you know. I'm excited for when the super timeline goes past the end of Z and what stories they'll tell there. It better not be GT. If they do GT again, I'm gonna be mad, okay? Just don't, just don't. Maybe if they made it like way better, I could be able to, oh, okay. Counters are a lot harder online because lag's a factor, but you know. Okay, no, no. Oh, I, I, okay, I, I see you. Oh, block, block. No, maybe yes. Hey, what's up, we're back, y'all, again. Said the break wasn't gonna be very long, but we are back and we have our friend here with us. We have our friend here with us, Diet Soda. Today it is a can of Dr. Pepper and cream, zero sugar. I love cream sodas. Dr. Pepper is great and Dr. Pepper and cream is awesome. Let's listen to the snap hiss as I open it. Ooh, hope y'all like that. Gonna take a sip before we get into this next mission. All right. Uh, you know what? Might do some more multiverses too now that I think about it. We haven't done that in a couple weeks. You know? Haven't done that in a couple of weeks. Couple of weeks, yeah. But anyway, now that all that's said and done, I wanna talk about the things that are supposed to be coming in this game um, as we play. So what we have to do now is we have to go back and we have to go to objectives as we're playing our Captain America. Alright, alright, hi. Uh, do it with a captain. Uh complete any war zone in the Utah Badlands region. Uh why not? Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay. Let's go to the Badlands in Utah. To the Badlands. To the Badlands. Is that a war zone? Threat sector. What is a war zone? I don't even know. Like, they're all war zones, right? Conic mission, economic mission, threat sector, drop zone. We should do a drop zone and like threat sector and do something like that. It's quick, you know what I mean? Drop zone. <clears throat> nah, why not? Let's do it. No, I don't want those rewards. I want the monies. Yeah, yes, I want this because I need to I need to buy more of those stronghold boxes or whatever because you can get some good costumes from them. That's another thing. Those little stronghold boxes, if you spend enough, you can like not spend any real money and get like a costume if you really, really want it. And that's kind of cool. You know what? Let's go ahead. 
status disabled. You know, I would put matchmaking on to play with random people if I was playing my max level, but I'm not right now, you know? Leveling up, Cap. All right, Avengers. We got word from our scouts of an attempted breakout at one of Ames. That prisons. is not. Those inhumans need our help. Dang, bro. Let's go get. No, I need people. to go back. Like that thing. They always like to start in the middle. Anyway, here's some things that are coming to the game. Winter Soldier has been confirmed as the next hero. Okay. Uh, I just need to remember what I need to do. Uh, yeah, high value bounty targets. That shouldn't be hard, and then the 25 enemies, okay. I wanna go back to his skills just to see everything that we got, you know? It's honestly, yeah, dash, excuse me. Like, all their moves are very similar. It's just, it's the ranged attacks that are like, and their intrinsic abilities that are really where they stand out, you know? Aerial attacks, all that good stuff. Sprinting, dodge and a hit, you know? Yeah, so it's all the same basic stuff. We yeah, Winter Soldier is the next confirmed hero, and people might be like, if he's the last the hero for a now. year, maybe we want to do a bigger hero, but there is, um, there are rumors of some bigger Marvel characters being developed, including Captain Marvel. We know that She-Hulk is being developed. When she's actually going to come, I don't know. Um, I'll be super excited when she does, and I will be mating her, because I don't care. Like, I will make her fit my playstyle, because I love her. Um, but yeah, like that's, that's I'm gonna make it work. Listen, I don't care. I'm gonna make it work. Anyway, he's coming. Um, join while in session. They're working on it because they want to have that done before they do What's a patrol that? mode. Which imagine a patrol mode in this game. I would imagine that would be pretty fire. Um, you just w run around as an Avenger it's fighting bad defense. guys. Hopefully in a place that's more public where you actually feel like you're doing superhero things. Like, you're basically going around and fighting crime. Like, how awesome is that? Super awesome, you know what I mean? Uh, hey, hey, what's up? Come here, come here, come here. Yes. Alright, oh, there's so many of you. Hello. Lock on, yeah. Can I do a... Oh, oh, whoa, hey, it's good. Hey, 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 hey. Hard mode. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, if you are liking what you are seeing on the stream, don't forget to leave a like on the stream. It does push the stream out to more people so we can have fun times together and enjoy the clan. So thank you guys so much for watching me level up Cap here tonight. We're having a good time and we're just getting started. Well, I mean, we're about halfway through the stream. <laughs> you know, we're not done. We're not going to be done soon is what I'm saying. But yeah, patrol mode is basically you're gonna be running around and like fighting bad guys, fighting villains, right? Bosses, and like doing like heroic Avenger stuff. So that's cool. And that's gonna be really fun. And that's gonna be really good. And I think it's gonna be really good for the game because it's not just like you're running around doing the same missions, which like that's the design of this game. It's a movie, right? That's kind of how it's supposed to work. But then you also have this mode where you're actually doing what superheroes have traditionally done in comics for a very long time i know the mcu hasn't touched on this a lot except for like um you know except for like spider-man homecoming where you see the patrolling and stuff and iron man is implied to have done it right in between iron man one and two but it's more like him going around the world to fight stuff by the way i forgot to mention just because i'm talking like feel free to put stuff in the chat i'll stop i'll stop my conversation or what i'm talking about to read your chats or if you want to comment on what I'm talking about. Like, just because I'm talking a lot, I do that for your guys' entertainment. Don't feel like that means I don't want to stop to read your chats. Because, like, I stop in the middle of all my sentences anyway. Like, when I'm just talking. So feel free to put something in there and, like, you know, <laughs> I'll answer it. Got any questions? You want to make a comment? You want to just tell me I'm trash at the game? You know, that's okay. That's all right. I will read it and I will appreciate it. Appreciate that you had the boldness to tell me I'm trash. You know, it is what it is. <laughs> Alright, this is a buff, so I'm excited about that. Yeah, let's go, let's go. What you want? What you want? What you want? Baby, I got it. And then boom. So if I do it with one, two, three, then I'm gonna do the same. See? You just you start you start with this. Oh wow. Whoa! <laughs> yeah, what you want? No, I'm gonna oh 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 okay. Yeah, I gotta get faster. My reflexes. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, uh, dodge, dodge. Dodge! Ouch! Uh-oh, uh-oh. I need to heal. Yeah, let's get rid of him. Let's get rid of him and heal. Wow. Wow. Okay. 
Let's free these guys now, okay? Um, but yeah, I think Patrol Mode is going to be really, really good. Um, they're working on some bigger Avengers for next year. They're working on a lot of stuff for next year, and it's going to make the game so much better. And I don't even think the game is bad. Like, you could just use more stuff, and that's kind of the point. Like, it's a live service game, so it's not going to be the most amazing thing when it first releases. Think about how little was in Xenoverse 2 when it first released. It's been six years. Think about how much is in the game now. So give it time. Give this game time to grow. It's going to be really good. But that's also part of why I'm playing it now, because, like, I don't want to be one of those people that's like, Oh, I thought the game was good the whole time when I haven't been playing it. Dang it. How did that happen? What did I get hit with? But yeah, I think it's, um, yeah. Will we, will this be a consistent game? It depends on how much you guys like to see me play it, right? Um, but I do think it's a, it's good. Ah, whoa. It's good and it's fun. And I just, it's just going to get better. Like that's the biggest point is that it's just going to get better. There are no high priority targets here. I just gotta take out all these guys without, you know, uh, dying. That's the thing, which means I gotta defeat, I have to defeat them, not they get defeated like by my team. Like, I have to defeat them. Oh yeah, what's up? Oh, oh, let's go, let's go, bye -bye, let's go bye -bye. Hey, let's go. I wish there were more Dragon Ball games, it's like current Dragon Ball games for me to play. Cause I know that like, that's what the channel, like a lot of what we do on the channel is Dragon Ball related. And while, I wouldn't say Dragon Ball is my favorite franchise. It's definitely up there for a reason, you know. Um, I could play Fighters on Tuesdays. You know, I just Fighters is just not my thing, and it's it's basically like it's it's the same type of game as Xenoverse, to be fair, just without the PVE element. You know? But I mean, I guess you can take that as you will. Like some people might disagree with me, but also. 2D fighters is not the things that I'm really super interested in. I just don't have a lot of fun with those things. The only reason I would enjoy it is because it's the IP of Dragon Ball, not because it's the 2D fighter, you know what I mean? Arena fighters, like the universe, I find fun. Also, I just need my Hero Academia Ultra Rumble to come out. I didn't get into the closed beta. I was so upset. I wanted to get in there so bad. And I would love to just have a good My Hero game. Like that's, My Hero 1's Justice, not that popular. Not that popular at all. We could do some more Swator on the channel. We could do that. Potentially. Ah, it would probably... Uh, we would play it on Tuesdays. Like, we're playing this, you know? Hey, we did it. We get all those ships, too. Uh, we leveled up. Hey, we gotta do uh, Brook and Brawler or whatever. I'm not even really paying attention to the objectives I'm supposed to be doing. I probably should. Well, look at all these fragments. I need to sell it for money. That's heroic orbs. All right, let's look at what we got. Look at their skills. We can get another uh, heroic attack, you know, or another thing on our all on our hero. I want to get all these before I get the other ones. Power 50, oh, level 30. Okay. Uh, Steamroll specialization two. Uh, every two enemies defeated with steamroller generates a regen pack. Every two enemies defeated with a steamroller generates a heroic orb. Every two enemies defeated with Steamroller grants an Intrinsic Orb. I don't even know what the Intrinsic stuff really does. Let's look at it, okay? Uh, the block, draining Intrinsic Shield, block energy variable, amount of space of attack, strong attacks will deplete all energy, unblockable attacks cannot be blocked. Uh, parry, just before they connect to parry, yep. Okay, reduces the block energy and they can, okay, well, I don't, I kind of want to build him out as a crit, but like, he has the shield, so I should probably build him out as a tank, right? Because my Hulk is, a, is not necessarily a tank. He's probably more of a DPS. But to be fair, I don't think the Avengers characters are necessarily supposed to be built in those traditional roles, you know? Cap's a little bit of an all-rounder, which is one of the reasons I like him, because I am an all-rounder. Oh, we have to open these. Hey! We got some. Ooh, yeah, I like that. Which way we need to go? Tell me. That way? Why that way? Did we go the wrong way? Hey. Hey! Show me! Dang it. I, oh, what? No. Where is the right way? Oh my goodness. This could be better. This could be better. Really? Oh, they just wanted us to go down. 
Why would you not just tell, like, we, I can jump. I'm Captain America, like, I'm Captain America. Guys, like, I can jump. Look at these hops, bruh. Look at these hops. Yeah, yeah. We don't have any bounties out here. That's annoying. Oh, I think that's a bounty. Look at that. All right, I'm gonna go get him. No, go away. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go get him, because I need that. Uh, I need that for one of my things. Yeah, let's go, let's go. Ugh. Don't tell me it's just a chest. Hey, yeah, I need to defeat him. Let me do this. Hey, let's go. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm gonna use this just because I need to defeat you. Whoa! Ooh, ooh, yeah, what you want, sir? What you want, sir? Hey, come on, come on, sir. Yeah, this is me. I'm taking you down. You cannot stop me. I jumped in the Did I get you? I swear if somebody took that from me, I'm gonna be so mad. I'm gonna be so mad, okay? You don't take that from me. You don't take it. You don't take it. I wanna check, but it would be kind of stupid for me. I'll check later, you know what I mean? Oh, whoa, hey, hey, what's good? What's good? What's good? What's good? Oh, you got some arrows in here? Yeah, okay. Woo! Let's go, boom, 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 boom! Oh, wow. Hey, what's, well, we got some resource stuff. Oh, whoa, whoa. Um, boom. But yeah, this game is in good hands, is what I wanted to say at the end of the day. And um, some games that are coming up that I'm super excited for that we're 100% playing on stream. Um, well, let me get the game out of the way that we probably won't play on stream, even though I want to, is Gotham Knights. I want to. I'm gonna have to check. I'm gonna have to check if my PC can run it. I don't have a next gen console. That's the only issue. And it's not releasing for past gen consoles anymore. I will get a PlayStation 5 at some point. At some point this year. Backup has arrived. Protect okay, maybe not this year, but like at some point in the next six months. I'm setting it as a goal right now. Within the next six months, I'm getting a PlayStation 5. Oh, whoa. Whoa, hey, what's up? What's up? I need to. Yeah, y'all need to chill. That's my goal. Within the next six months. Boom. Ah! Oh, whoa. Hey. Oh, whoa. Ah! Oh, oh, dodge. Yeah, can't stop me. Can't stop me. Oh, yeah, come on. What you want? Boom. Oh, that didn't work. Okay. Oh, yeah, we can do attacks. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no, I wanted to do it right before. Oh, hit you. Hit you. Boom. Oh, I knocked you away. That's what I did. Cause I'm strong. Okay, there's a train outside. I don't know if y'all can hear that or not. Hello, friends. Boom. Oh, sorry, sorry, Tasha. They mean to do that. Defeat all enemies. Whoa, there's a lot of people coming up. Okay. I don't know if I've gotten the 25 or not yet. You know. All right, this is actually a time where I need to use this. My problem in a lot of games is that like I want to save my stuff like heroics and like health things and stuff so then I never use them and so like then they just never get used so I gotta use heroics and stuff more you know different like in Xenoverse you gotta use them sparingly you know when the opportunity arises you just gonna fail you know but it is what it is I'm getting a little bit better at that kind of thing hey I made more enemies we got Whoa, more waves. You think this you think this is gonna you think this is gonna stop me? You think this is gonna stop me? That's cute. You're cute, you know? Oh, hey. Boom. Oh, 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 I do not apologize for what's going on here. Because you cannot stop me. Boom. I'm gonna get you too. Boom. Oh, oh, ooh, 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 ooh. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Can I, I need a bag, I need a block. Hold up. Ah, 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 ah. Yeah, let's go. This is what we do. This is who we are. We help people. <laughs> oh, did y'all see that uh, Spider-Man No Way Home is uh, being re-released with like extra content? Like 11 more minutes of content back in theaters? I didn't realize that that movie was released December of last year. Like it's been that long, which is surprising. Honestly, I'm really excited for uh, this week's She-Hulk. This was something to talk about, you know. Um, last week's She-Hulk, I liked it. I mean, this show's good. Like, it's not blowing me away, but I really like it. And I really love She-Hulk. And I love all the Hulk stuff we're getting, so that's cool, too. 
this other episode, I wouldn't say it's bad, but it had to establish a lot of stuff. So there wasn't, there's not really a lot to sink your teeth into, except the big thing that everybody's been talking about is that um, when Jen is looking for a job, she, um, okay, you know what? I'm going to read what this does. I have to, okay? Because um, I don't know what it does, I'm going to be honest. A steamroller. Oh, I know what steamroller does. Up to four enemies. Rally cry. Uh, enemies in proximity. Those attack rally cries are marked. Enemies marked. Take additional damage. Okay, so they take additional damage. That's fine. Uh, Brooklyn Brawler. Uh, the power shield slam that refills intrinsic energy and stops enemies in their tracks. After the shield slam, all damage and offensive strength is increased and a new light combo is temporarily available. So this is just a big buff. This is just buff. It's, it's a buff. Okay, that's good to know. Yeah, again, Cap is an all-rounder. He's an all-rounder. He's an all-rounder. I gotta defeat as many people as possible, because I have 75 more people I have to defeat without dying. I mean, I don't know how many I've done so far. Hey, what's good? Ooh, oh, I didn't hit you. Look at this, though. I do like his style, you know? Hey, let's go. Can't stop me. Oh, oh, hey, what's good? Boom. Whoa, hey, hey, ooh. I, all my energy is gone, which means I can't block stuff either. Which is why I probably don't want to waste on those attacks, to be honest, you know? Hey, okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna take it, I'm taking it, I'm taking it. Boom, boom, shock and maki. Hey, can't stop me, can't stop me, can't stop me. Hey, oh, snap, hey, what's good? Hey, how we doing? How we doing? I'm gonna just do, boom, boom. Oh, oh, okay, yeah, let's go, let's go. All right, let's, let's hit you. Hit you? Well, I'll also hit you. Come on. Hey, oh, hey, 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 who's hitting me? You need to stop, okay? Oh, hey, what's up, Natasha? I will defeat all of you. Boom. Yeah, let's go. Boom. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, Brooklyn Brawler is ready. Hey, I'm gonna do this. And bam. Oh, never mind. Ooh. All right. Ooh. Two, three. Oh, okay, how do I do this combo? One, two, three. Nope, I think it's four. I think it's four to do the heavy. One, two, three, four. Okay, yeah, it's four light and then one heavy. All right, I'm gonna do this. Bam, dodge. Ooh, yeah. I forgot about those dodge hit attacks, bro. Be the saying, yo, it's been a while. Yeah, were you here on our, were you here Friday or Saturday? <laughs> Thanks for joining the stream, Lee the Sand. We're just playing some Marvel's Avengers, leveling up some Captain America, talking about uh, She-Hulk, talking about the future of this game we talked about. Um, oh, hey, let me defeat you. Well, well, sir. Um, talking about the future of this game, which I think is in good hands, because here's the thing, the, the um, takeover of Embracer Group buying Square Enix is now official. So, they have officially bought it, and so, they have to re they have to like rebuy the licensing for Marvel's Avengers, but they said there shouldn't be a problem with that. This game's not going anywhere. They're hiring people on to These make new content. New heroes are being released. They're planning content for next year. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. Um. Mm. We're also talking about She Hulk. The, the big thing. Okay, this one's a buff. Yeah, they're marked, which means it should be easier to defeat you now. Ow. Dang! Whoa, whoa, hello! One, two, three, four. Oh, I'll just do this. Yeah, that's the big thing. Um, in She-Hulk last week, when Jen was looking for a new job, um, on that internet site, there was an article that said, Man gets into bar fight with metal claws. Wolverine is officially in the MCU. Listen, there is no way Kevin Feige, with all the talk of mutants, with them getting their rights back, everybody wants to see mutants, them calling Miss Marvel a mutant, there's no way that Kevin Feige would put that in there as just a tease and have it not be Wolverine. Fighting with Metal Claws is one thing. Fighting in a bar with Metal Claws is another. And here's why, because Wolverine gets in bar fights all the time. Like That's specifically Wolverine. So it's not only his powers, but his personality and his character, okay? So Wolverine is in the MCU. So he's probably been there the whole time, right? That's a wreck. That's probably a retcon, you know, technically. So I don't, mutants did not start coming about just because of the snaps. Here's what I think. Here's my theory on mutants in the MCU. Here's how I think they're going to handle it. Mutants have always been in the MCU, just in small numbers, right? 
Okay, so mutants have always been around, and then it's the snaps. So the X gene's been around for as long as mutants have been around, like in, in the comics, right? And that means that across the centuries, there could have been people that became mutants, like Wolverine, like, you know, James Hallett in the 1800s, and Sabiner in Egypt, which even in Moon Knight, I think, there were some references to um, the Pharaoh that is Apocalypse. Well, no, there was references to the Pharaoh that was Cain, maybe, not Apocalypse. Um, but yeah, that's a thing that's happened. And so throughout history, there have been characters that have had powers, probably, that have been mutants, and we just don't know about them. You know, some, some older mutants. Uh, mutants haven't started popping up in bigger numbers until the snaps and the blips, because all the energy, the cosmic energy that was released by using the Infinity Gauntlet three times, is what has now activated the X gene in the greater populace. So I think mutants have always been around. It takes a certain type of radiation to activate their X gene and to activate their powers, like Miss Marvel with the bangle, right? So it can be triggered by different things, but I think the snap spread out so much energy, like Rocket said, that all that cosmic energy is what is now empowering mutants. It's activating their X gene like never before. So now the X-Men are gonna come about because now there's gonna be a lot more mutants popping up and so there'll be a need for like you know professor xavier's school when there wasn't before because like maybe there's a couple mutants around the world each generation now there's going to be hundreds even thousands popping up all over the world because of the snaps so mutants have always been here but they're just coming in in bigger numbers because of the infinity saga and that's a nice way to tie in the current mcu into the past mcu and show that like these decisions do have consequences right it's not just, oh, we beat Thanos and everything's okay, and there are no consequences from time travel and, you know, using the gauntlet all these times. Like, no, there are consequences, right? And so mutants come, which means more heroes, but also more villains. And so I feel like that's how they're going to explain it, but it's really cool that Wolverine is officially in the MCU. Like, they haven't said Wolverine's in the MCU, but like, listen, a man got in a bar fight with metal claws. If that is not Wolverine, I think Feige learned from the whole Ralph Boner thing that people got super mad at, which apparently that guy is a big character. Apparently, that's supposed to show up in the Fantastic Four movie again or whatever. Like, there's more to him than just being a guy that was like, I don't know, brainwashed by Wanda or whatever. Um, yeah, that's exciting. The Wolverine thing. I don't really care about the Ralph Boner thing. I, I honestly, I honestly don't. I've never cared that much about Quicksilver. I just, I just haven't. Not a character that's been that interesting to me. Not even among the X-Men. It's other X-Men that I like a lot, like Wolverine, because he's awesome, and like uh, Psylocke, because she's cool. Storm. I do like Storm. Jean Grey, because Telekinesis is awesome. Not Scott, because he's a jerk. And he is a jerk and unfaithful to his wife, and just he, he's not a good. He's he's terrible. Okay, he's just he's just bad. I don't like him. You don't like him. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. No. All right, whatever. That's fine. It's fine. But yeah, that is that is super cool. Hey, where's my shield? Oh, <laughs> I, I wasted it. I wasted it. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, we gotta rescue him. Stable the shield. I got to get over there. Oh, we. Oh, well, we have 20 minutes, okay? Listen, this is not gonna be that difficult. Hold up, oh, hey, hey, you need to stop, you need to stop. Come on. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Did you see that? I like that. Oh, hey, 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 what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Hello. Get out of my way. Come to America. Go, 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 go. Run, run, run as fast as you can. Can't catch me, I'm the gingerbread man. Oh, now that's a combo. Okay, we gotta do this, and then we gotta like fight people. Right? You we gotta now do? destroy the associated cell, but hurry. Cool. We have to destroy it. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Whoa! Hey, hey, oh, whoa! You know what? Okay. You know what? I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do it. This is probably near the end of the mission anyway. Okay. So all you people should be easier to defeat now. Ugh. 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 Boom. Okay. Do we have to destroy one before we can activate the others to destroy? Because it'd be cool if we could have just activated all of them. And, you know, that would have been nice. But I don't think that's how that works. Because they wouldn't make it too easy on us, which is fine. Because why would you want it super easy? Uh, ba -ba -boom. Excuse me. 
Hey, no! We ran out of time. Man, that's rough. Why are there no stairs up here? Like, I'm doing parkour, but like, listen, I don't see any stairs in this actual room, bro. That's weird. That's weird. All right, we gotta do this. No, hold, 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 hold. Hold the line. Love isn't always on time. Love isn't always on time. It's not in the way that you know me. Hey, it's not in the way you say you're not. It's not, uh, they can't copyright me if I'm singing, right? I'm a hum the Avengers scene theme and instantly get a copyright strike. <laughs> oh, hey, Prince Vegeta. Nice to see you back on the stream. Um, last thing we talked about was my theory on how they're going to handle mutants coming into the MCU. And I said, I think mutants have always been in the MCU. Like the, like the X gene has always been here. Like since the, I think it was the Shi'ar. It's either the Shi'ar or the Kree that experimented with humans back when they were like, you know, not as civilized and put that X gene in them. Why is my targeting not working for my shield? Whatever, I'll let you guys handle these guys. Um, and so mutants have always been around, so that explains ancient mutants like Apocalypse and Wolverine, who was born in the 1800s, because guess what? Wolverine was just confirmed to be in the MCU by the She-Hulk episode, because one of the, um, there was basically a news report that said, um, man gets into bar fights in bar with Metal Claws. So Metal Claws, obviously Wolverine, and also getting in a bar fight, also Wolverine, that's his personality. So, because of those things... We are convinced that Wolverine is now officially in the MCU, and there's no way, like, Kevin Feige knows what he's doing. He put that in there on purpose. He owns the mutants now. It's not just a tease. That shows that Wolverine is in the MCU. When are we going to see him? Who knows? But, like, he lives for a very long time, and I think that's why Kevin Feige did that. So there's, they're starting to tease mutants. Like, this Marvel was the start of it, and did you think they were going to slow down? No, because Marvel always teases stuff out. And while we're not going to get X-Men on screen for a while, they're going to be teasing it. And so we get those little nuggets to keep us going and to make videos and theories about. Because again, oh, oh, no, 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 no. Feige knows what he's doing. Feige knows what he's doing. By the way, again, if you guys want to join, you know, the next mission, just put your PSN in the chat and I will give you an invite. You just became MatPat with these theories? Oh, man, well, it's a Marvel stream, so we should be talking about Marvel stuff, you know what I mean? At least a little bit. Um... Like last week, we talked a lot about my thoughts about Wakanda Forever. Um, but yeah, that's my theory. Oh, my theory is that so mutants have always been here, and that's why there's mutants that are older. That's why they're not just popping up. The X gene has been here for a while, but it's the um, uses the Infinity Gauntlet. Remember, there were three. There was Thanos' snap, there was Hulk's snap, and Tony's snap. The energy released from it, which, um, you know, Rocket said in Endgame, like it released a lot of energy. That energy was enough radiation to start activating the X gene in a lot more people, which is why we're gonna see a lot more mutants pop up. Like, it was rare to see a mutant before. Like, there was maybe a couple around the world, you know, probably less than 100 every generation for centuries. And now, all these superpowers, all this energy, all this radiation is causing the X gene to activate rapidly with a lot of people and so now we're gonna see like mutants popping up everywhere which is why you know Xavier self in school will need to be the X-Men and that kind of thing because it's not just like oh we can hide under the radar because there's just a couple of us where like this person is a hero or has these powers and doesn't really understand them but like there's only one of them so it's not a big deal and they're not gonna really be heard about now they're gonna be popping up all over the world all the time and so now it's gonna have to be a thing that has to be classified and it's gonna have to be talked about and i believe that because it takes radiation to activate the x gene right even in the original comics the reason the x gene started activating so much was because it was in the 60s and they were starting to experiment with nuclear power for war and for energy and so they were like because of all this radiation the x gene is being activated so the x gene has been around for a long time apocalypse was in ancient egypt he was the first mutant confirmed like confirmed like that's in marvel comics he is the first mutant man that did not do as much damage as i thought it did and so obviously there wasn't a whole generation of mutants when apocalypse was around neither when wolverine was born in the 1800s they start becoming more common because radiation is used more it's getting exposed to the air more so it's activating the x gene 
For instance, Kamala, the Bangle, activated her X gene, and that's why she can use her mutant powers. And so now, since all this cosmic stuff has been happening and all these superheroes are popping, because think about it, phase one, right? Only three actual superheroes. Bruce Banner. No, only two. Nice Bruce work. Banner and Captain America were the only Everyone actual superheroes. Hand, Tony made a suit. Hawkeye Ready and Black Prime. Widow are humans, and oh, Thor is an alien. So he doesn't technically count as a superhero, at least Earth-based. And then what happens? By the time Civil War comes around, there's enough for two teams of people to fight with a lot more people with actual superpowers. It's the Vision even talked about this. He said, start small. But like more superpowered people are coming up out of the woodwork. And you know, it just escalates from there. So it starts small and more and it happens more and more and more. And this happens in the world. Somebody learns a technique to do something. Oh cool. Now we just have to do this one. Defeat high value bounty targets. But yeah, uh, a technique, you know, people develop a technique, then somebody else uses that technique and makes it better, and then more people learn about it. Kind of how like in Avatar. Uh, lightning bending was super rare and then in Korra like firebenders do it all the time because one person figured out how to do it so more people learn it and then now everybody can do it same thing with mutants random question of the day are you interested on um, playing cuphead someday no I'm gonna be I'm gonna be straight up honest just just no I might be interested potentially potentially and some other games that are kind of a little bit outside this channel's usual content, but 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 not Cuphead. What was I looking for? Oh yeah, the Nick Fury mission chain, which is up here. Um, open strong box. Where do I open the strong boxes? In drop zones? Can I track this? I am tracking it. It should show me on here. Why aren't you showing me where the missions are that I need? Um, Wakanda. Hey, what's up, Wakanda? Wakanda forever. Uh, man. Okay. Uh, in in Pacific Northwest. Okay, Pacific Northwest. So we have to do one in Pacific Northwest. Um, if there is other things you want me to try, though, like especially on the Tuesday streams, because we have a lot more flexibility to try things, let me know. Let me know. I don't want to do a hive. I want to do a vault. Villain sector. Are there any vaults here? Villain sector. Shield faction mission, villain sector, conic mission, drop zone. Let's do a drop zone, it'll be quick, and then I can see if I can open some strong boxes. Ooh, and get some high priority targets. I'm trying to do a mission and the objectives for Cap, you know? So it is what it is. But yeah, that's kind of my theory. Of how Marvel can bring in the mutants without having to like not have old mutants like apocalypse and wolverine or explain why they're just coming in just the now in modern day so i'm really excited about the future of mutants in the mcu and the fact that wolverine is officially in the mcu because that's just pointing to nobody else but wolverine like, that's exciting that is awesome um, Warning. But yeah, this area will be well we, we, Marvel's getting good. I've also been reading the comics again, starting with the comics again, like catching up with it because I got to read Secret Wars before the movie, you know, um, and I've been meaning to catch up with the comics anyway. Did I get, I did get more. Look, I got more monies. Yay for the monies. We'll need to take control of their system. You know what I should do? Get me to oh, I have higher power, power gear. I'm gonna get shot. Ooh, I haven't done this. I'm gonna use my emu. I gave him a thumbs up before I destroy them. Dang it! I'm so used to playing Xenoverse that I just did the lock on move. That's exactly what just happened right now, and I wasted my heroic. It's okay. Though. Oh, whoa! All I have to do now is defeat high priority targets and open lock boxes. So I need to actually. Whoa, whoa! Hey, what's good? Oh, oh, dodge, dodge, dodge! What you want? I'm gonna hit you again. All right, and I'm gonna do heavy attacks on you. Boom. Ow! Whoa, hey, who's over here? Excuse me. Oh, okay. Hi. My name's Captain America, and that's my shield. Hope you enjoy- Oh, hey! Ow! No, I can't die, I can't die, I can't die! Oh, wait, I already did that one. That's fine. <laughs> I still don't want to be down, but, like, it's not a big deal no more. Oh, but I might start finding games that are, like, multiplayer games or whatever that have, like, Alright, just gotta open two more. Okay, there's nothing in here. 
Not that I see. Unless there's a way to open it from this one, because sometimes in these missions there are, but I don't think this is one of them. Yeah, you can't get into here. That's fine. There's nothing in here from what I see. Um, what I was saying is that I might try to find like a games and try them out that have like mini Dragon Ball games built into them and stuff, you know? We'll see. We'll see. I just need these other games to come out, these other anime-based games. My Hero Academia Ultra Rumble, which I gotta look up some news for that, and I might make some videos on that, because I like making news videos, actually. I like talking about my opinion on stuff, and like when stuff's coming, and what I think about it. Um, I do like that, you know? It's fun. Whoa, dang, that guy was fast. Hey. Oh, we gotta stay in range? Oh. Okay. Okay, I can do that. I can do it. Can you stop me? Ow, hey. Oh, oh. Hold it, hold it. Hold the line. Hey, what's good? Oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, gotcha, gotcha. Boom. Yeah. Hey, let's go. Let's go. You know what I might try to do? I might try to get to level 29 in one of the Dragon Ball Online Global games so that we can stream at Tenkaichi Budokai. Excuse me. Um, if I do that, like, I might tell you guys on Friday and or Saturday. I don't know if I'll be streaming this Saturday, actually. I think I'm supposed to be going somewhere. Um, but I could probably honestly get back soon enough to, like, you know, do a stream. And, like, I'll tell you guys, hey, level up a character in this game because it's free to get it and play it. Especially because it's a private server that people brought back so they legally can't make money off of it and it'll be awesome. Um, oh, whoa, hey, let's go. I'm gonna get you. Hey, let's, look at that. Four people. Boom. I'm gonna get even more. Look at that. Yeah, taking you out with the swiftness. I'm getting used to cab now. I'm getting used to cab now. Boom. Ouch. Hey. Hey. Okay. That's fine. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Oh, ah. Hello. 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 You can't stop me. Whoa, okay, maybe you can. I'm gonna use all my heroics here, because these guys are big, and we gotta stay in this circle, so you know. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, okay. I'm getting frozen. No, no, I'm not gonna let it get frozen. I'm gonna stop it, and you're just gonna have to let it go. That pun is 100% purposeful. Please don't hate me for it, but you're allowed to. <laughs> ah, wow. Ew, look at the graphics getting all weird on me, though. See that? Oh, whoa, hey. Look at me getting all capalicious. Oh, out of the way. Out of the way. Oh, oh yeah, 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 let's go. Oh, oh, ah, I'm gonna get frozen. He's gonna do a big attack. No, see, see, okay, you see that? You see that? I mean, they're not cheating me. They're using good teamwork, but dang. Hey, oh, 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 ooh. oh, yeah, yeah. Well, my kick take you out. My kick, I'm gonna let my kick take you out. Yeah. Boom. Hey, 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 stop it, stop it, stop it. Hey, oh, oh, hey, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Oh, uh, man. Oh, 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 hey, hey, ah. boom, hey, whoa, whoa, let's go, let's go, ah. oh, let me just take it, oh, look at that takedown, y'all, that was awesome, that was awesome, nice work, yay, we did pretty good on this one, but yeah, My Hero Academia, Ultra Rumble, and Dragon Ball the Breakers will become regular games on this channel unless they suck. And I don't think they will because the content creators that have been able to get in on the games on their tweets, they're talking the about how like it's fun. To the they're saying it's good. Like both of those games are good and that makes me happy. Uh, let's go ahead and select. We can probably knock this out here. And if we do that, let's go to a mission that's going to be um, uh, Pacific Northwest. We have to do it in Pacific Northwest, I'm pretty sure. Let's go to Objectives. Yeah, Pacific Northwest. Two more strong boxes. Okay. Okay. I'm really liking Cap now. I want to do a shield one. Shield faction mission. Yeah. No, we got to make this harder. Excuse me. Give it some kind of challenge. Nothing? This will be easy. I don't want it to be easy. Whatever. Fine. I mean, we'll do it. It's going to be easy, but we'll do it.
Well, it's mission. What is... I don't even know what's coming after She-Hulk. What's the next Marvel thing after She-Hulk? I think it's Wakanda Forever. I don't think there's any more shows. Um, and then after Avengers. Wakanda Forever, that ends Shield Phase 4, and Phase 5 starts with Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania, which I'm so excited for. I'm super scared because they're like, uh, people are saying they might kill Ant-Man. Please don't. Paul Rudd is a treasure. I don't want him to die. I really don't. That would break my little heart. That would break my little alien dinosaur man heart. And they'll do it again. It's too dangerous for my agents, but I need that list. Hey, we got Spidey with us. Why is he not sitting? I, like, I find it hard to believe that he would not be sitting down. You know what I mean? Like, we're not fighting yet. The plane is flying. Kate and Cap are just standing. They might buckle in for the landing. I don't know. Or maybe it's, like, super smooth flying because it's Avengers tech, you know? I'll be excited for more story stuff in this game. Aim doesn't care about their security forces. You care about your agents. I might try to level up so we can do, like, raids and stuff, like the high-level content. Cause that's some fun stuff that I haven't actually done before. Like the raid, I haven't done the raid yet, the claw raid, you know? Gotta get some really high leveled up people though. Higher power gear available? How? Just those? Okay, There's I'll take it. Let's go! Yay! Boom. Boom. Take these guys out. You got it. Whoa. You got it. it Alright, I'm running for you. You can't stop me. Bam. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, oh, hey, whoa, 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 I want to open those lock boxes. I gotta get those. I gotta get that stuff done. I need to get stuff done. And by getting stuff done, I mean objectives. Cause I can't think of words. Cause I'm playing and talking at the same time. And it's hard, but I try my best. Apparently, not try my best in singing though. Like definitely. Oh, oh. Let's go ahead and take all these people out first. Definitely do a bit better than that. All right. So, wait, did my music run out? There's no way. You know what happened? It didn't start. It didn't start this one at the beginning. Man, y'all like have not heard the beginning tracks of this mix in a while. Because it keeps starting in the middle, which is annoying. Even though it plays to the end. So you would think next time it starts, it would start at the beginning. But it don't. Ouch. Oh. Oh, oh, yeah. Hey, yo. You know, I can't wait to unlock the community tab. Like, that's one of our next big goals. 500 subs, unlock the community tab. Because then, I can ask you guys, before the stream, what you want to see me play. Give y'all options, and then just play that, you know? I'm not going to do that every week, but, like, we're still experimenting on what to play Tuesday. Friday's locked down. That'll be Xenoverse. Like, forever, you know? Obviously. Um... But like on Tuesday streams, and then Saturday streams, you know? Saturday streams are where we experiment the most, I'd say. Because Tuesday streams, I wanna I wanna settle into something you guys wanna see every week, you know what I mean? Ooh! Ooh, we just gotta get, this should be it. This should be the two more we need. One more. Yes! Oh, we leveled up, let's go. Let's go ahead and get this stuff now. Yeah. Yeah. Better gear. Thank you, sir. What skills we got? Let's unlock them. Specialty. All right, we're going to get this one. And then we'll get all these ones next. We'll, we'll level up. We'll actually level up the abilities themselves. Um, while Broken Brawler is active, takedowns can be performed on critically wounded enemies. Um, while Broken Brawler is active, light combo finishers have increased impact and deal with guaranteed critical attack damage. While Broken Brawler is active, range attacks and impact are increased. I like this one because takedown. No. No, we want to take down as many people as possible. Takedowns take a couple seconds. It'll slow you down. I think critical effect is, is important. I think that's good. Uh, so cool. We got some stuff. We opened all those lockboxes. So now we can just finish this mission. 
and uh, get some high priority targets if we can. I'm not worried about this. We're just going to go. I am going to go this way to see if this is a bounty. We've only got one out of the five. We got a cosmetic item. I don't know who it'll be for. Maybe we should log into Spidey or Hulk because I want a costume for one of those. Or Jane because I don't like the one she's wearing, but I don't like... Okay, this is just a lockbox. I'm not worried about it. I don't like the costume she's wearing, but it's better than like the base one, in my opinion. You know, I want something, I want something cooler for her. I don't know. I don't know. Hey, if I played a superhero MMO, would you want me to like make some Dragon Ball characters in it and play that? Like, would you like that, guys? I'm just throwing out some ideas here, things I'm thinking about. I want to get your feedback because you know we're a team, Con Clan. Just as much as I want to play stuff that's fun, I want to use stuff that you guys will enjoy, too. Um, and that's a thing, too, of, like, just... Oh, wait, hey! Oh, okay, I'm just gonna keep going. It don't matter. I'm just gonna run it out, because we're running out of time. Oh, do I have to fight these guys? Maybe. No, hey, where, where are we going? Where are we going? Fine. Oh, yeah, we have to, actually. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, I knocked him out. I knocked you out of the sky, sir. Let's go. Oh, oh, there's more? Oh, we gotta fight where there's fire. I'm not trying to not trying to be on fire. Oh, hey. Dang. I knocked him to pieces. To pieces. Oh, uh, but yeah, that's why the community tab will be super good too, though. That'll be fun. That will be fun. I could maybe start getting into more like anime stuff. I don't know. I have to watch more animes. Uh, I wish there were some good My Hero Academia games. There's gonna be one coming out soon, but I want more. Because huh? My Hero One Justice Two is—I mean, it's also an arena fighter. I just like—it's not that popular. All right, one more, one more. And like, it's fun and all, but like, I don't know. I'd have to learn it like I do Xenoverse, but I don't even know how many people play that one anymore, to be fair. Any word from Amon if they know we're here? Nothing yet. Do they know? It seems luck is on our side for once. Famous last uh, never. Take them out. I don't believe in luck. Never tell me the odds. Hey, what's good? Hello. I'm gonna have to do that. I do not apologize. Ooh. Oh, hey, hey. Oh, I knocked it back at you. Almost got you. Destroyed it. Dang, he can throw a shield pretty far. I mean, he is top of the bar. He does have super strike. Yes. All right, let's keep going. Unless there's any bounties. I don't see any extra bonus Michigans here. This is probably going to be our last mission. So we got that objective done. We didn't get all the ones on the, on the progress track, but that's okay. And I might end it like slightly guns. early, depending on how long this mission takes. We only have seven minutes for us gonna end anyway. But I'm not gonna go long because I, I need to, I need to get that. I need to keep working on that video, and I don't have too much time after this tonight before I gotta go to bed for work tomorrow. I'm an adult, which means I have a job, and so this becomes my job, ah! which is the goal. You know, that's that's the dream. All right, let's just go ahead and do this. Oh no. You know, this is when to use the heroics, for sure. Everybody that's in here, uh, I don't think I hit anybody with that. Which means they're not actually going to be easier to defeat. I need to take a- whoa, okay. This is burning me. You need to stop. Hey, let's go. Oh, I'm going to use this one too. Use all of them. Why not? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, look at my combat. Can't stop me now. All right, yeah, I should get more crits too. I should get more criticals. Oh, because that's what I upgraded it for. Oh, yeah. Boom, boom, boom. Look at that. Oh, wow. I'm getting criticals all over the place, sir. All over the place. Cap is definitely an all rounder. I don't really have a lot of commentary to say on him other than that. You know what I mean? Like, he's good. They're all good. They're all fun. They play like you'd expect these characters to play for the most part. I only really have anything to say about heroes in this game if they're bad, you know what I mean? Because I will say, 
They all have uniqueness with their heroics and their playstyle, but their basic combos and stuff are usually very similar. You know? It's in the small differences that you can really make them unique. But they have a lot of, like, they're, a lot of their bases are similar in how they fight, or at least the buttons you press, which is nice, because then it's not like you have to completely relearn each hero. You just have to learn their cool little specific stuff to be good with them, but their basics, you can kind of pick up any hero and play once you know how the game is played, which I think is a smart call. I think it's a smart call to design it that way, so that way every hero is accessible for everybody. Every hero feels like they're easy to pick up, but hard to master, and that's what it should be for a game like this, because you don't want any character that be so hard to play that people don't want to play them at all like you should at least be able to pick them up and if you're not super good with them you shouldn't be terrible with them you know so that way you still have fun and then you can see what the character's about and if you're like oh i like this character i might level them up and try to like make them really something special right that's how it should work not oh this character is foreign to me like speaking another language compared to the character i main so I don't even want to try them, you know, or like I try them and I just I'm terrible with them and we fail the mission Shouldn't be like that. Shouldn't be like that. I like the way they have it set up This game has a lot of potential and it is good. It has been good since it came out It just hasn't been perfect, but it's gonna get better and better and better. You know what I mean? So I do think this game has a big chance to be something good Oh, oh. whoa I destroyed you. Oh, hey, oh, trying to hit my teammates. Hey, no, go away, go away, go away. You're just gonna kamikaze me anyway. I need to find these things and destroy them. Hopefully this doesn't take forever. Oh, it's already 8.57. These missions always take long, but I won't stop in the middle of a mission, you know what I mean? Unless I fail. Whoa, oh, I have to break it so I can pull it out and then break it some more. Okay, so I did the right thing the first time. Oh, come on, what you want? Hey, what you want? Baby, I got it, ooh. What you need, baby? Oh, ooh, I got it. Ooh. Hey, yeah. Uh, I'm singing. Uh, I'm singing like a pop song while I have like epic music playing in the background. Cause I'm in the middle. Too. All right, where's my last? Is down here. Oh, no, I don't want. To. Oh, ouch! Hey, get me in the back, bro. Lame. Cowards. It's a man in the back. How dare you do such a thing? No. Jarvis is extracting the list now. Oh, okay, Good. cool. Is that it? Monaco have a hard time putting a list together like that again. Is that it? Now that AIM's grown as an organization. I look forward to Ooh. welcoming our new allies. I feel like Yo, that was it. This soda's so good. Delicioso. But that was it. That mission was not as long as I thought it would be. Yo, oh, we got to, we got some monies though. I like that. I don't need to open those strong boxes or whatever, because I don't care about the costume it's gonna give me. Looking forward to it. I, I just don't. Thank you, Thor. Um, I require no thanks. Select. You welcome. I'll leave you to it. If I finish this mission, oh, you gotta finish the entire chain, I'm sure, before you get the cosmetic item. But we did it. Oh, just talk to hero set random mission chain rewards so we'll probably do that next time or i'll do that off screen because i might just want to do some like next time we play this game do some really big content but uh, we might not be doing this game consistently on tuesdays uh we'll see what happens but that is it for today con clan thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it if you did please be sure to like it whether you're watching this live or you're watching this later i thank you so much for watching and um yeah thank you please do the youtube stuff please put some likes on this it helps push the streams out to other people so we can grow the con clan and if you have people that like seeing gaming content and like these kind of games that we play please let them know about the channel so we can grow the con clan and have so much fun together but i appreciate all of you guys Still gotta come up with a name, Macon Clan members. All right, I think I'm close. We'll figure it out. But again, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching, and just remember, be as daring as a dinosaur. Peace out.